Hi, I'm Frank. I'm a Taiwan Smart Wall Holder Company CEO and co-founder. So imagine, if you have to pay for something that you may not need, it's a waste, right? But what if it's an insurance for you? So it's not a risk, it's not a waste. It means this is a waste, you have to pay for it. Also, company face some problems here. So our customer, they are machining ceramics because uh, in the semiconductor production line, there are many uh, cer uh, uh, ceramic parts, okay? And ceramic parts is so hard that you have to use in diamond knife to cut it. And the diamond knife, diamond knife is very expensive, okay? So they have to switch every 24 processes. Even if the knife still can be used, but you still have to change it because you have you you cannot take the risk to break a knife to break a tool because if you break a tool then you have you lose your worst piece and your production line will going to stop so here is the scenario as you can see if this thing happens in their production line then they lose 3000 uh, 300000 immediately and they have to stop everything so, if I can tell you precisely when will something goes wrong, then you won't need to waste this, uh, this tool and you can pre prevent the risk also. Our algorithm can tell you when the tool is going to wear or when is the tool is going to break. As you can see, we can monitor the cutting force and the torque in real time. So if the tool is going to wear or going to break, then the tool, then the torque is going to increase immediately. So our company can improve the machining industry all around the world by two to fifteen percent. What is the CNC machining industry about? Your iPhone, your MacBook, Tesla's transmission even your fighter jets, all made from the CNC machines. And these are, these are the companies who build these machines. Okay, and these companies all need the CNC machine and our sensors to improve and to improve their productivity and reduce their waste. So, Taiwan Smart Tool Holder Company, Taiwan Smart Tool Holder Company and make you to trust your machine and reduce your waste and improve anything in your production line. Thank you. Oh, hello. So uh, tell me a little bit about your company, please. Okay. Uh, Taiwan Smart Tool Holder Company is, uh, have so solutions for machining companies like uh, machining uh, ceramic or machining uh, metal. And uh, I help them to increase the productivity and decrease the waste and the cost of the tool. Yeah. And, and uh, it, essentially, you're putting a sensor into a tool head yeah. to enable them to eliminate downtime by predicting when the tool head is pro probably going, about to break. Is that right? Yeah. Yes, that's right. Because uh, in a machining tool tip, there is uh, coolant and there is uh, metal chips and there is very hot and vibration and the speed is very fast. So there, there is no uh, sensor can survive there. So we try to uh, move our sensor up to the tool holder and we combine the MCUs, batteries, Wi-Fi's, and sensors inside. And yeah, combine each other and using algorithms to try to calculate the force on the machining tip. Mm. Yeah. And, and by calculating that force, you can understand when there's degradation, is that right? Yes, that's right. Because you can imagine like, uh, when your tool is uh, wear, the force is going to uh, increase because uh, you have to yeah. take more power to uh, remove the material. Okay. Yeah. And uh, so, does that mean if uh, I can use a tool longer, if it's still okay, or I can, if, if it's going to break, then I know and then I can fix it before uh, I have to shut the whole machine down? Is that what it is? Yes, perfect. Yeah, that is a good question because uh, in our industry, there's a big problem is that uh, CNC is very hard to automation because you don't know when when it will go wrong 
and you don't know when you will uh, break a tool. So you always have to send someone and wait, wait beside and to prevent and fix the problem. Yeah, but with this, and you can make everything automatically. Your machining and your management can be improved. And the data is fed into what? Uh, uh, it's manufacturing system somewhere? I mean, how? So it's within their own interface. Yes, that's true. And we can combine the data flow to uh, their own management system. And we are the first company in the world who create the cutting force big data okay. of their machining process. In the future, we will have CNC GPT. Okay. Yes. Very good. That is the future. That's uh, nice. Tell me where. What made you start this company? What's your background? Okay, uh, my background is uh, uh, mechanical engineering, mm. but uh, we also uh, study some uh, neural network and some uh, dynamic system. And uh, our team has another like uh, uh, electrical engineering engineer and uh, mathematical system control, something like that. Yeah. But what gave you the idea to do this? I mean, okay. that's very, very focused. Okay. And you know, Taiwan is the top five CNC machining export country. And uh, there are so many uh, uh, CNC uh, factories and finding our teams to say, hey, are, we have some uh, machining problems. Can you fix that for me? And different companies have uh, different issues, but all of these issues can be solved by a real-time monitoring cutting force system. Okay. Yeah, so this is why we create this. All right, so how long have you been going and what's, what's next for you? Okay, uh, uh, we have been, uh, actually we are start out in this year. Okay. Okay, but our future is that, uh, not just for CNC machine, if any industry needs our embedded system technology, we can help them. Okay, the core is uh, how we embedded the sensor and your electrical board and your mechanical system and your control system together to solve your problem. Yeah, so our core is the, our core is the uh, way to embed in everything, yeah. And uh, so you just, you said you founded this year? Uh, you founded the company this year? Yeah, that's right. So how many people are you and uh, have you got any customers doing this already? Yes, uh, we have uh, 12, uh, 12 uh, employees in our company mm -hmm. and there are some uh, machining companies cooperating with us, okay, like uh, three or two, uh, we have uh, three machining companies uh, covered with us, and there are uh, two uh, manufacturers who create uh, some different type of machines. They have different issues who uh, need our uh, technology. Yeah. So are you looking to raise money to continue this growth path, or what, what's next for you? Okay, I think uh, for us, the most important thing is uh, what is the demand of the uh, factories all around the world. Okay. Why is their issues? And the issues means they have to solve this. And we want to find this problem. And if we can find this problem and using a good way to solve it, then we are not uh, worried about the uh, raising part. Oh, yeah. That's uh, very impressive. Yeah. Well, thank you very much. Thank you.